So my beautiful people, I am back with another Elden Ring video and today I'm going to showcase you guys the rotten staff and how you get it. How's it going guys, my name is DPJ and if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so the rotten staff, look at the size of this thing. Now when I first got it and it popped up on my screen, I'm, I'm looking through my, my weapons and I'm like, where is this thing? It ain't a part of my staff, where is it? It's, I didn't get it. And then I realized, guys, it ain't a staff at all. It's a colossal weapon. That's what it is. And it hits like an absolute truck and also causes that Scarlet Rock buildup. This is actually a great, great weapon. Uh, and for those looking for people that want a weapon at scale with uh, strength and dexterity, like a hybrid, this is definitely for you. So. Before I showcase you to you how you get this thing, you will have to kill an enemy and a boss, but you will have to kill an enemy. Let me just, uh, now this ain't leveled up by the way. I just want get, to get, uh, gather all these ads up and see what it does. It's got quite a funky special attack. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Come on. Come on, lads. Come on. Come on, watch me just get absolutely obliterated here. <laughs> Come on. Come on. I want to see what it does, see. Boom! I will sit on your face, bitches. That's it. You piss me off. I'm going up here. I'm gonna do a WWE top rope special move. Are you people ready for this shit? Hard. Boom! <laughs> Don't do much damage, but like I said, uh, I'm not strength and dexterity. If I'm honest with you, I haven't gone for anything like that whatsoever. This weapon isn't scaled up, but I'm guessing for the right person. This could be an absolute. I mean, look at it. Whoosh! It's a base. It's a base. It just takes years to swing, man. Well. Boom. Oh, I landed on his face and nothing happened. Yeah, I don't want to land on one of them spikes. That will be awkward. So, yeah, let's run away. Let's run away. It looks like a bit of a fence, to be honest. Okay, sit back down here. Okay, so. This weapon you obtain from the Halic Tree area. And you need to be a dude who's roaming a bridge. Now the Halic Tree area, guys, is endgame. It's right at the top up here. So yes, I will have a guide on how you get to this area. There's a portal within this town right here, which is a part of the, the um, hidden path to the Halic Tree. So yes, you need to use the Grand Lift of Road to do that. Search YouTube for a guide, guys. There's plenty out there. Um, but yeah, travel north, come to here. There's a little quest thing you have to do it takes about five minutes and it will activate a portal but i've got a guide for that in the video description so make sure you do that once you get to here guys um i've actually got another guide which i'll link down below which shows you a route i take which unlocks every grace and you barely get touched by any enemy and it just makes a uh, guys like this much much easier because i can't be running from the top every time i want to showcase a nice item in this area that i find because videos will just be too long so yeah, use that guide as well guys, unlock every one of these graces and we are good. So this video will start um, and the location will start from the prayer room area. Uh, you'll come basically out of here guys and there's like an, a, an enemy roaming here. It's a big dude, but there's a door you can run to and hide in. And if you've got magic range, magic can kill him quite easily. I wouldn't, I wouldn't fight him on the bridge unless you got some decent melee damage on you. Um, he hits like a tank. But you'll see all that on screen now guys and how I beat him and basically he drops this rotten staff and it really is as easy as that guys so yes if you enjoyed the video leaving a like really helps out if you like what I see and want to see more out of ring be sure to subscribe and hopefully people I will see you on that next one